Good morning, Marissa. Good morning, New York City. You're right. Did you show Daddy your watch? I saw that. Wow, that's a girl's watch. It's oh, not a girl. A boy. You are a boy. Thank God for that. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Ma. Ma. Show your muscles. In my religion, food should not wait for a person. A person should wait for food. Yeah. Fully. Woo! Super zoom. <laughs> Excuse me while I zoom out. Good morning. Hi guys. How are we going? Did we all like Vlogtober Day One yesterday? That was fun. I feel like you just sort of, you know, get in the swing of things. I'm sorry, I'm talking to my, I'm talking to my vlog. I know I'm sure you're like, can you talk? Oh, do you want to be in a vlog? Okay. He wants to be in a vlog. Hey. Hey. Hey, thank you. Okay. Um, yeah, just getting in the swing of things and everything, but that was fun. I know I didn't have a coffee on there yesterday, so now you have my coffee from Marissa, my Starbucks New York mug. Uh, I just wanted to go over some housekeeping for Vlogtober. I didn't do that yesterday in day one, but I want to for today. Um, meaning like what's going on. We have a pretty busy month, I think. Um, I th I think Willie's planning something for my birthday. I'm not quite sure. Mum's um, sort of thrown some hints. My birthday slash our anniversary. So I think he's planning something for that. I'm unfortunately not going to be able to get down to Melbourne for my godmother's cancer and wellness walk this year. I, I've gone other year, the other years um, to support her for that, but I'm not going to be able to get down there this year. Good of you. Good of you. Um, just busy with the babies obviously, uh, but everything else obviously I take you with me I've got to do a few things for preparing for summer Summer is very hot in Australia, and I hate the heat hate it and um, So I have to prepare for that. So we're probably gonna do I think an ASOS haul that I've been preparing That will be that I think I'm gonna look for a new pair of summer shoes probably sneakers but just lighter like I've worn through my ace sneakers with the bees worn through them it's crazy uh, yeah I don't do clickbait clickbait is when you do a topic or a, yeah like a description of your video and the content inside that video doesn't match so like saying I'm pregnant and then there's nothing to do with being pregnant inside the video I don't do clickbait, just to be clear. Every title of these Vlogtobers is going to be something that happens inside the video or like a line of what I say or a question that you guys ask me. I did this a couple of Vlogtobers ago and it works. It's, it's much better than thinking of a title. Like if someone asks me like, you know, do you love your Louis Vuitton Neverfull? Sometimes I put that as the title and then that's the question that's inside. Everything will be content inside the video. So just want to say that. I smashed my Range Rover yesterday. So obviously that was the title. So anyway, I just wanted to say that as well. Um, what other thing? What other thing? What other thing? What other thing? Okay, that was my update for now. All right. So, we are getting on the road. I'm going to drop Zaki. Do I have a flat? No. <laughs> Great. 
great. I'm going to drop Zaki at my mother-in-law for the day. He'll stay there and um, I've got to do, oh, damn it. I've got to do some work. So yeah, we're jumping on the road. I've got to head up to Will's restaurant. Um, I'm doing, finishing off an installment there and I've just, I just totally forgot. I've got to get something. <laughs> One minute. <laughs> That's really dirty. Really dirty, Zaki. Yucky. Lucky you got baby wipes. So yes, that is what we're doing. We're taking baby. We're taking baby to my mother-in-law and gonna go and do some work. I've just got these new tables for the restaurant. Wait till you see them. You're gonna die. They're amazing. They are so amazing. Oh my god, they're such a good find. If I don't make it, pearls. Okay, our plan didn't work. My mother in law had to rush out because our manager's having a baby. Good night. Go to sleep. You were asleep. So one of the managers in the restaurant, would you like to tell the vlog? Would you like to tell vlog Vinny, Toba? My manager in the restaurant is supposed to be having his twin girls, twin girls, um, in November, end of November. His parents are coming end of November. Today, they will be 32 plus five. And one of the one of the twins isn't very comfortable in there and they've decided to do a cesarean schedule, well, schedule that for today. Yep. Since... 32 plus five, that's twins. It's for twins, it's not it's bad. Not it's not bad. bad. Look, okay. it's not bad. Like, they'll go into special and care, but... the beautiful but... thing about it is, is when you're going public in Australia um, and you're having twins, it's like going private with the best specialist available. Right. Because they really look after you. Yeah. Because twins, they need a lot of care. They've already been incredibly helpful, the public hospital. That's awesome, so. yay. So that is where my mother-in-law is. So Mr. Magoo came with mummy. And I'm just getting some pearls of wisdom business from my amazing business partner. Look at the shade. I'm I'm being serious. Though. He's teaching me. Ten times ten. Remember that? <laughs> Two. <laughs> oh, <laughs> nice at ten. I didn't I didn't think the ten times through. I just thought plus. Still not ten. <laughs> <laughs> no, I said twenty. I said twenty. <laughs> I said twenty. I said, he said 10 times 10, I said 20. But he was laughing and I was like, oh, he said times. Okay, whatever. Okay, Max is not my strong point. <laughs> but you make up for it elsewhere. Oh, do I? Yeah. Like this? Ah. Just your laugh. Oh. <laughs> That's rude. Okay. Frank just called Willie. He's a smash repair guy. Yes, Frank did call me. Well, he didn't call me, I'm sorry. He sent me an email, two in fact, just to make sure that I got it. One in his office, one himself personally. <laughs> and my friends, it looks something a little bit like this. <laughs> For a side mirror, they can bake you apparently a cake to do your washing. <laughs> Wait, All that sort of thing. wait, is he, is he going to do it in parts or is that, is the whole unit, we can't, he can't do it in No, so he does like one piece of glass, then in liquid papers, that piece. Oh my God, he said I might not have to order an entire new unit. What his words. What's left on the unit? Is there anything <laughs> left to the unit? <laughs> <laughs> yes. The back cover, the unit itself, the glass and the internals are gone. <laughs> We'll have a chat then, but you'll have to put it through insurance, which is going to be a quarter of that. Yeah, thank God. Thank God. Okay, you know how I said you got to see my new tables? <laughs> Come.
come on so we're doing some beautiful cocktail tables outside we're gonna have them permanently locked down um, and have some beautiful bar stools so that we can do cocktails during the summer it's it very busy out here during the summer but we've got some cocktail tables so nice This is what happens when we get hungry. We feed the baby and then the chef feeds mummy. And what do you call this dish? This dish is a rough plowman's breakfast sort of thing. Oh! With fried eggs, sumac, a hint of the Middle East. <laughs> Hint. Oh, hint. Sorry. Of the what? Middle East with Smack. steak and eggs, barbecue sauce. Steak and eggs. Yum. And then he made me. I love steak sandwiches because you know it's not like ton and ton and ton of meat, but it's just you get your steak in there. Yum, thanks Willie. You're welcome. Okay. Alright. Oh no, it's okay. Oh, okay. You are fine. You are fine. Okay. So I'm off. I've got an appointment and I am taking Zaki. I think mum will babysit Zaki for an hour while I go to this appointment. Oh no. That doggy looks like Queen. Oh, that dog looks like Quincy. <laughs> That's really sad. Okay, I have finished my appointment. I stopped in quickly to grab some gross, like not groceries, but some extra things that I needed. And I picked up some little cheapy earrings, little cheapies, little cheapy hearts, but they're nine karat gold, but they're on sale. How cute is that? I have, I have to have gold, high maintenance, ear person I have to have full gold or gold plated earrings I've worked that out it's so cute look it's a little heart and a little solitaire they're CZ's but as my mother-in-law said do not at your age do not invest in diamond diamond like big di diamond earrings because you change out your earrings so much you'll probably lose them which look word to the wise it's a very clever thing she said just get you know a good quality like little cubic zirconia little CZs uh, and in in gold so cute so that's nine carat gold not plated it's actually nine carat gold 
and I change them out so much like I also have my um, say Elsa Peretti no the Paloma Picasso X's from Tiffany & Co but I can't keep buying Tiffany & Co for like I have six holes right so I have my X's graffiti X's and my Wii so I sometimes have that and then I leave the front open sometimes to wear you know more of a costume jewelry piece why am I telling you this but they're cute no okay now we're gonna go home at sorry yes oh lucky I said that I do need to go home because mum needs something for Mussy needs some clothes and his bunny and his swimming bag actually so I have to go home and get that and then we'll go back down and get Zaki. I need to stop at the post office. I need to stop at the bank. I need to stop at the dry cleaner. Yay, welcome to daily life with me. How is everyone doing? Are you liking my Vlogtober? Loving this guy. Okay, along with realizing how user-friendly and easy a camera bag is from my little um, nude camera bag, <laughs> a bucket bag is 10 million times easier because you just it's that's it right I just think I have too many flat bags in my life so anytime I get something that's really user-friendly I go crazy Hello. are you a bit hot in your hair Hello. are you right yes He's too hot. Twinkle, He's too twinkle, hot in the sweater. To stop. <laughs> oh, no. He can't, mummy. His face is backwards. It's not. Oh, I say hi to the vlog. Oi. Hi to the vlog. I forgot it's October, so this is going to be every day. Uh -huh. A bit of ha ha. Welcome to my life. Welcome to my world. <laughs> Everybody was so excited to see you oh, on yesterday's really? vlog. Yeah, they were already commenting saying it's so nice to see you. All oh, right. Well, because I don't, I don't we're actually not showing, I don't doing I, videos anymore. We hadn't done like I've a girl. had such high demand for a girls' <laughs> outing, and I keep having to say I have to rely on my daughter. Oh, so excuse me, who is the international jet setter? <laughs> State jet set out going true. everywhere with my godmother. We've had a very busy few weeks. Um, but we're back on board and we're going to be doing a video together very shortly, maybe Whoa. someday. Listen. That. Oh, oh so Chuchi, 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 twing. I think I get more joy out of that. Whip you up. <laughs> the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Wow. Twinkle, um, okay, twinkle. anyway. Okay, anyway, Twinkle, Twinkle. I think we need to get on that because. I know, I'm worried sick they won't take it I'm back. worried so you see on Sunday? What? Can you make Sunday? yourself available Sunday? Of course. Right. The so vlog has to come with us. The vlog? The vlog comes of course. with us. The vlog comes or Saturday. With me everywhere. What can we do? I told them it's actually quite a busy month. But, I think but hang on a second. So you're organising Sunday. something with William for my birthday. Surprise! But I did tell them I wasn't able to get down to Melbourne for Liv's walk this year, which we did last of October. We did so much last of October. Mm -hmm. Wait, did we go to Melbourne last of October? Yeah. And yeah. New Zealand? Yeah. Oh, we were just jet setting. I'm going to do an SLG 101. It's like starter SLG 101 because I pulled these two out of my drawers as I was leaving the house. But the, oh, the bag's in the car. But this. The infamous starter piece recommendation 
from anyone from Louis Vuitton is this. It really is. And 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 I part agree. I, I do agree. I agree that you should probably start with an S or G and start small simply because there's room to grow. I am going to do a brand starter video and tell you my thoughts. Got to get in the studio for that. That was something else I wanted to tell you with housekeeping for Vlogtober. I may not necessarily vlog every day, but there will be a video every day. So if I do sit down videos, I'm going to upload it with a Vlogtober day attached to it. Do we all agree? Yes. Comment below. So I'm not going to necessarily vlog every day, but I'll, I'll do sit down videos because some people like sit down videos too. They like reviews. So I feel like that mixes it up a little bit more than vlogging every single day. However, Louis Vuitton clay, clay pochette, which they still have, thank God. You can still read, readily available get it. I'm not quite sure, probably not. <laughs> Seeing as though it's so hard. This was my first ever piece of luxury. Even before my Gucci sulky bag, this was, look at it. It's in the most horrible condition. It is so tarnished. It smells horrible. It smells like that old musty mothballs metal smell. I hate that. 2008, I purchased this, my first ever piece of luxury. Do I recommend it as a starter piece still rather than saving for say a bag? Yes, because you will get a bag as well. But also what's not far off, and I don't have a six key ring holder anymore to show you, but six key ring, so the six key and this shout out to my beautiful Monique, my beautiful Emerald Queen, my subby Monique gifted me this coin, zippy coin purse. There has been, sometimes when I watch other reviews like, um, you know, like Dior wallets or whatever, I see Dior wallets or Chanel wallets come out, like obviously inspired by, okay guys, this was the original. The Zippy coin purse was the original, totally inspired by, you know, it's not a new design. Um, you know, Louis Vuitton own this design and this is definitely, definitely a fantastic piece to invest in. I had it in the multicolor, in the white, and then I was gifted this supremely amazing monogram. These are fantastic starter items and you don't need to worry about like, well, should I just save a bit more and get a bag? Uh, no, because you'll be so addicted <laughs> from just this that you will eventually save up for a bag. However, in Chanel, what is different about Chanel is that these SLGs are a bomb, okay? They are really expensive. In, in the relative sense, you're paying $700 for a mini O case, okay? And then, you know, you can, so three SLGs of the ton are not gonna get you, like it's not as if it's like closer to a bag. It is closer to a Louis Vuitton bag, but with Chanel, SLGs, it, like there's a lot of girls out there who don't waste their money on SLGs because essentially five SLGs, you're, you're closer to a handbag. So I feel like with the two houses, it's a bit different. Does that make sense? That's my information on this video is that I feel like with Chanel, I wouldn't probably do starter pieces as SLGs. I would save for, you know, maybe um, a flat bag, a cocoa handle, something that's in a, in a mid range. Don't Maybe you can save for a classic, but damn, if there is a price increase coming, that's just, that's, it's straight in the guts. It's heavy. That's a lot of saving. Whereas going for SLGs with Louis Vuitton is a little bit easier to swallow and it will start the addiction. Trust me. That is, <laughs> I'm being mocked. That's my info on luxury. 101 for this video for this for this vlog table i'm being mocked by my mother and my son not at all are you mocking me zaki we're just about to have some organic pumpkin <gasps> and spinach and ricotta pasta that's gonna be a lovely nappy for mummy thank you nice. she's mocking me oh my god <laughs> <laughs> get the face 
Get the cake. Yummy. Mm -hmm. Are you eating? Good boy. I'm so happy to eat. Okay, we are going to say bye on the vlog. I uh, hope you enjoy Vlogtober. Vlogtober day two. Thank you so much to everybody who responded to me saying yesterday like is vlogtober old news now is it like is it like a done thing but you guys said no it's kind of like an og only like og youtubers can do it so it's a bit like me a done thing <laughs> putting out to pasture over so thank you so much for the support please leave a comment below on luxury if you want to know any questions like i just did a style piece 101 let me know so that I can always add it into each vlog because we're doing that a little bit of luxury and yeah. And if you check mine, I did a 202. Oh my god, okay, all right. <laughs> See you in tomorrow's vlog, guys. Bye. Bye.